cryptocurrency is a hot topic these days. So a lot of people are researching about cryptocurrencies and they are trying to figure out how to trade, basically how to buy and how to sell or maybe how to convert cryptocurrencies into another form. So today let's talk about Kraken which is the most popular and most used digital currency platform and actually this is uh, mostly used in USA but uh, even in other regions in the world this can be used so let's see how to create a account in Kraken so these days actually a lot of people are trying to create accounts and uh, this has created some problems with the platform basically in the website so uh, let's see how it goes so uh, if you are a beginner and you want to uh, create an account you have to go to get started and input your email a new username and password so then your region will be selected automatically and you have to take uh, I'm not a robot and uh, proceed so then uh, you have done it and so you have to go to sign in and in here in this page you will see there are only two text boxes basically username and password there's nothing else you have to just input the username and password you have entered in the previous step but once you sign in you will see there is an error coming up and it will say your two-factor authentication code is invalid but what happened because you never input a uh, two-factor code so let's see how to fix it so basically you have to go to your browsing history and you have to clear all the your browsing history so I will show you how to do it so you have to go to advanced tab in here and select the time range as all time and tick all the boxes and clear click clear data and this will clear all the browsing data from your browser so the next thing is you have to clear all your cookies also so what you have to do is you have to uh, enable this option so in my browser I have already done it so you have to do it so do it so uh, enable this and then you have to just close your browser the totally close your browser and uh, start a new session and then try to sign in and it will work thank you